Bossing, skilling, guides. <laughs> hey guys, what is up? It is Guzzy. Welcome to another video. This one's going to be a loot from, it's going to be episode 3, and it's going to be on a Saturday, which is... Uh, not typical of me. I usually take the weekends to recuperate and stuff, as I said on uh, yesterday's video on Friday. This one is going to be 2,500 crystal keys uh, at the crystal chest using the Luck of the Dwarves ring, which is a new tier 4 luck ring uh, after the luck rework from last Monday. Now, in the background, I'm just doing... Uh, I think it's it's sped up by 20 times, so it might be a little weird seeing it, but I wanted to at least show half of the footage of me opening the crystal chest so that you know that I'm legit and I didn't just buy these things on the GE. You never know what someone making a video would do just to get people to buy crystal keys or to buy these certain items. You never know that sort of stuff. So I hope that um, this is about an hour of a sped up clip and it's sped up 20 times, so it's about, you know, three minutes, three and a half minutes, and then I talk about the loot at the end. So I'm just going to have a voiceover here as I'm doing the uh, the stuff in the background. It was really intense. Um, for the first hour, I forgot to even listen to music, and then the second hour, I was like, wait, I can listen to music to pump me up. Um, so the way I went about this method is I had 12 keys in my inventory, an upgraded gem pouch, and a crystal teleport seed. Uh, you can have either the attuned one or just a bunch of the normal ones. I just I don't have the uh, stuff for the attuned one, so I have a bunch of normal ones. And then I have 12 keys in my yak as well. Basic method is to use um, the teleport crystal to go to the seventh option, which is the Ioworth, Ioworth district, then run south. Um, and then you surge as you get onto the stairs. It's That's pretty much where I've seen the best way to uh, surge is. And then once you get there, uh, maybe I will have a slowed down version as well so you guys can see what I'm doing. But basically, I open the chest, and I have uh, the two number two key bind to the... Um, to the gem pouch, the upgraded gem pouch. And I have the third keybind to call my familiar. So when I get to the chest, I call my familiar. That way I can click on it and um, open it up. And then I do have the uh, screen markers on my screen. Those are the the, uh, the boxes that you see on the screen. Those are completely legal. Um, totally fine to use those. So basically I spam click on the crystal chest and I also spam the number two key which will put all the dragon stones, all the normal rubies or the diamonds into my uh, gem pouch and then I will unload it at the bank. One thing also to note is that I use the tooth halves and the loop halves that I got uh, during opening the crystal chests about halfway through it so I started using those uh, as much as I could so I can get more items out of it because getting those themselves uh, is not, I don't think it's worth uh, keeping those in your bank. You're going to end up putting them together later, so you may as well put them together while you're opening the chest as many as you can. Once you're done with the 12 keys in your inventory opening the chest, you can click on your yak and then hit the deposit all button into the familiar and then right click a crystal key and then take out all of the crystal keys that way um you can have the crystal keys in your inventory and now you have more space so you can do another 12. i did test doing 13 and i did test doing 14 in the inventory and then 14 in the yak um, both gave me some issues 12 seemed to be where the sweet spot was down to me i've lost my pulse and humanity like it's sin man i have no heart try to get it back don't know where to start oh i gave my all and supported you through was loyal but can't take Thank you. 
Alrighty, finishing up my last five crystal keys, uh, and then I'm gonna look at the loot, but damn, that is one intense type of runescape playing. I am not gonna lie. Um, I don't imagine anybody doing this for long periods of time. I did almost 2,500 of them. I'm just going to check the bank real quick to see how many dragon stones that should um, give me a, a number as to how many I actually did. Yeah, okay, so I did a total of 2528. That includes like the uh, tooth halves and the loop halves that I put together at the bank. But uh, I'm going to drag all the stuff out of the bank to see how much I actually made or lost. Okay, so I grabbed all the stuff that uh, you can get from the crystal chest, and I also wanted to let you know that I got a hundred, I don't know if this is exactly how many I've gotten from it, but um, I have 141 of the crystal blossom trees, and uh, a little bit over a thousand crystal motherload shards in my bank. Um, those are both rewards from the crystal chest, so, and these are used for perfect plus potions, so those are nice, but... Um, I'm going to price check all this stuff, but first I'm going to, uh, well, I bought all of the keys for 43,000 each, and I used approximately 2,500 of them, which is around 107.5 mil. So if we have more than 107.5 mil um, with all this stuff, also, I'm not sure if you can get a coin drop. It doesn't look like you can get a coin drop, so um, here's hoping. That this is over 107.5 and it's not it's underneath it's 105.9 so i actually lost a little bit of money and i didn't get a dragonstone armor so that's kind of bumming come on that's weird so it took me around two hours to get all of those done the first hour i did around a thousand of them and the second hour i started to learn um you know the rotation of it so it took me an hour for the uh, the last 1500 of them but that's kind of a bummer that these are it's not even it's not even profit man I actually lost some money so um yeah I don't know seems like uh, I don't know I guess you shouldn't do it but um actually I can't say that because you can get this for you can get the corrupted ore from this so anyways thank you for watching and i uh, hope to see you monday for uh some new videos so i'll see you then peace thank you so much for watching the video i hope you enjoyed it hope you have a great day follow me on social media and subscribe for more peace Lions roaring in the morning sun, searching for a longer day people feel